These are things that you need to know when you're looking at your spot. Chat, how much time is in a slap barrel? Do you guys know? How much sprint time is this? Do you guys know in the exact second the AI spawns? You need to know how far this pack can take you in every direction. Just slide here, boom, to the road. So the pack can take you there. Now we just rinse and repeat. You just go back. Eventually, by the end of today, we're going to have all the distances figured out. I'm not going to land Ritzy. I have no want or passion or care to land in this POI. I'm doing this for you guys. Yo, chat, how many hours do you guys have on Epic Games? If you go to your Epic Games right now and you go to this right here, your library, you go to the right ear here and you do the little three lines. How many hours does it say you have? All right, we're finally back on the game after like a five minute break from crashing constantly. Let's go. I'm happy with my like quick little in and out fighting routine here though. Like I feel like it's really, really smooth, consistent. I don't really want to be here that, that much. I want to go look at this other loot route. I'm going to continue to drop in on the POI because I want to always try to get any practice I can get. Like whether it's one guy, I don't care. Just need something. Also, looting the POI, I'm getting like way, like I'm understanding what I'm seeing here. I, I get these buildings pretty easily. This is free ass brick right here. Come on now, nah. top and bottom. Oh, this is huge. And you have it all here. You have it here, here. There's easily a thousand brick here, easily. And it looks like you have it over here. So you have a lot of these brick things. This is this is definitely important to look for. Like if you land any of these buildings, you have this right here for mats 100% of the time. Especially if you're like fighting somebody here and you're you're low mats, you just come out here and you smack this. Or maybe this is really good mats. That's gonna be huge. Yeah. So drop maps. What I'm doing for Ritzy is a combination of kind of both of what you guys, are, well, at least the, what I'm reading. I'm, I'm, I have a drop map that was given to me by the guy who I always get drop maps from. He makes solid first options, you know, something that's going to get you started. And then you got to go in and you got to tweak it. So have a starter. You need something to base it off of. Like you can make your own drop map. You definitely can. And the benefits of making your own drop map or at least tweaking a drop map is you're actually, every time you're doing it, every, every game you're dropping in. So you're learning, you're learning where the drop is. Not even have to think about it. I've been playing for three hours and I've been tweaking at this drop map. I know this is a marker like this right here is a good marker, like perfect. This is a good marker right right here. That's a good marker. Right here is a good marker. Uh, This tree, it's going to be here is a good marker and here is a good marker. I don't have to even think about it when I'm in the bus. Like I'm going to confirm it because I'm still learning it. But like imagine I have five days of this spot a week. I'm just opening the map. Oh, boom. Marker done. Like it's that simple. And then every time you hit that marker, let's say you're playing a tournament, you get out dropped. All you do, go in creative or go in real uh, replays and just be like, oh, you know what? This is why I got out dropped because this guy had a better glide or this guy hit this marker slightly ahead of mine, which means, you know, now you just move your marker up. You just replicate his drop. No, dude, don't switch cars, bro. Is this real life? I don't even care if I die a storm, bro. This guy's dying. Like, this guy's on my hit list. 100%. I'm full griefing this guy. I'm done. Like, this guy's... He's, he's just... He's annoyed me too much. Dude, Miles. You're on my de mouse pad. Oh my god. I'm dead. Dude! This cat is on my mouse pad. Look! He comes and lays down on the mouse pad. And then I'm, like, trying to push him off. And he's... Swat in my hand like he wants to destroy me. If only that guy knew that I just got griefed by my cat. This is the criminal. This is the criminal right here. All right, I'm pulling my glider. Okay, I want to see. I want to see how much time. Chat, how much time is in a slap barrel? Do you guys know? How much sprint time is this? I know I've wrote that down somewhere. Like, I know it's a number. It's one number, but like, I'm trying to. One minute, 30 seconds. 30 seconds. I think it's 30 seconds. It's not 15. Do you guys know in the exact second the AI spawns? Let's just see. Let's let's, let's see how long it takes us to get up the hill. Let me get stopwatch on my phone out. These are things that you need to know when you're looking at your spot. Okay. Let's see. I'll even I'll make it as easy as possible because you ideally you'd set this up. Oh, uh, boom. Let's see. Still got sprint. We're at 20 seconds. I think it's 30 seconds long. And with your actual sprint, you can make it. Yeah. So it's 30 seconds long to here. What we're going to do is very simple. It's not rocket science, but this is stuff that you need to know, right? Again, you can show this to your new teammate and you can literally go from here to here in 37 seconds, 37 seconds. Boom. Boom. Go in the discord notes forecast AI when zone closes at 141. What? That's exactly when it spawns or what? That's one thing that's huge, right? And you can do this in every direction here. This was so this was this is easy to draw out, right? All you gotta do is this zoom in on the marker, draw it again, but not actually complete it. You can run 250 meters with this with this chug. Okay, you can go all the way. You can chug run. Essentially, if you have this spot claimed as well, or you know, no one's down here, that's 37 seconds, right? You can do it again. Boom, 50 meters. You can go all the way to that. So ideally, you wouldn't go straight. You'd go, you know, you'd go at a little bit of an angle. You'd go like this 37 seconds for all this, give or take. I mean, this one might be a little bit less because it's not a direct shot. So like, it's not exact, but you can test it. You should test it, right? All the way to the boat. Oh, yeah, you could. I'll try this next game. But yeah, you definitely could. This is also okay. Now, Connor, those are things like okay. 
I want to make this clear when like I have the chat that's helping me like come up with some of these ideas and like like Connor, for example, you could hit the zip line. But like this is this is potential cash cup rotates. This is grand finals surge potentially. Imagine you're uncontested and you save this and you rotate straight to here. Boom. You go straight down to here. Okay. Then let's say you go hit right, right to what Connor said. You go straight to the zip line that's right here on marker. Okay. Boom. You you go right across the zip line that's fastest transportation. Hit the pad. You need to go find out like how the, how far these pads take you, which I'm gonna note this in the in the channel as well. But you need to know how far this pad can take you in every direction. I'm gonna do it this game right now. I right, look. So the pad, let's 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 think about a couple things. Bait spots, right? Where could you get baited on the hill? Could someone sit right here and bait you? Possibly. Unlikely though. This is a probably a bait rock, right? Like you could easily put a whole duo behind this. So when you come up on this hill and it's not breakable, it's an actual permanent item. So you just you have to build on this every time. You have to build on this rock. This one's breakable. What's the mats on this? 50 builds. Is the pad breakable? So the pad's unbreakable. So it's always gonna be there. And yeah, you could super pad too. So you should test that, right? Test the distance with flow berries, without flow berries. But let's see right now. Let's see how far this can take us to the north. We'll go straight north here. Pull your glider at the max height. All you're doing is gliding straight north. I'm looking right. I'm not gonna move, but you can easily make this zip line on the left, right? And there's one right in front of us we could easily hit. Let's go around it though. Boom. 22 seconds on the clock. So in six seconds, in the time it takes to glide, plus six more seconds to swim, you can make it up to here, which is if we mark the hill, you just went 665 meters. And if you super pad, right? If you had berries and you super padded, imagine where you could go. This is very simple. This is what you have to do when you're learning your spot. We're gonna go to a new loot lake here because this is gonna be for this is gonna be just for the slap barrels. So we're gonna go for the pad. Boom, it can take us from here. And you wanna be really exact with it. You wanna be very, very exact. It can take you to here. Boom, that's one That's one option. Now you can, you're can. you gonna go and you're gonna do this way and you're gonna do this way and you're gonna do this way. I'm gonna get all this filled out for you guys, so don't worry about doing it. But when it comes to your spot, you need to learn these things. That's option number one. We're gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna save this. We're gonna go to the Discord. We're gonna create a new channel called Pad Distances. Boom, and we're gonna create a channel called Slap Distances. Okay, so we're gonna go in here, new save, copy to clipboard. It's just same process, same formatting, right? I talk about formatting a lot. You're gonna go in here. I could do a more zoomed in image, but I know I'm going to replace this, so it's fine. Boom. You can see that's one, and we're going to continue to update it every game we play. Slap distance. Also, I didn't realize you have these as well, right? Like, imagine you're uncon and the entire POI, you just get these. You could probably go here to here, there to here, and just, you could, I mean, you can go super far. You don't have to even use this pad. Let's do this. Let's change the color to red as, like, these are the best two options, and then we'll do yellow as, or we'll do, like, a, we'll do, like, a, do a blue picture. Boom, slap distances, save, copy link, paste it. I'm in here, remove the embed, make it look all fancy, nice and clean, remove the embed, done. Okay, now the rest of the game, we can we can vibe out, do whatever we want, and then we go next game. This is the process. Eventually, by the end of today, we're gonna have all the distances figured out. Do so you know everything you need to know? Wait, I need these grapplers. Come on now, dog. Always, all, that's, that's Fortnite I want to want, bro. Always build around your loot and secure your loot. Like, all right, keep going. Get this, get this ranked dub. And then we'll keep learning. I'm just gonna fight this guy because I just hit him 70. Coincide. Oh, he's gonna go from the side. Okay, and a little peanut butter peek. <gasps> Come on now. Come on, head out. Up a Medi Betty. Here, one more person lurking below me. Was it the AI? The gun is just too busted. Like, I don't know what to say. This guy surely won't come down, right? You wouldn't do that. Yeah, see, you wouldn't do that. Top two. Guys, let me get a W in the chat. 85? W in the chat? Oh. Woo! No way! Victory Royale! Let's go! A w all right so we've got the drop map or we've got the we've got the distance here we're going to continue to to map out the distance and the sprint distance we got all the pad distance here or not all the pad distance we got one pad distance we're going to fill this in as we go the slap distance is here yeah i know i know when the ai spawns but i want to know when the ai like actually spawns and i want to know the spawn spots like there's spots that they spawn in you know it's not always i don't think it's always the same one they maybe they have like a route or maybe what's the distance between they can like when they aggro like those things give you a lot more knowledge there's only one spot or right, we're about to see that way i can test pad stuff too without being shot at all right i want to test this just to confirm okay boom Go. We should be able to easily make it to pop that. Save that barrel for the very last little rotate you got. Boom. Not even an issue. And speed doesn't matter on a zip line, so this is useless, but that's perfect. Right, it wears out exact same timing. We come right here. Boom. Hop off. Okay, now let's think about distances here. Where can we go? Where what's what's valuable to know? I mean, definitely going south. Obviously, we don't need to go back north. Well, I'll test it, but yeah, and we've got two pads here on both ends. I mean they're both useful, but let's just see. Let's go diagonal here. Like you want to definitely, this is definitely not that important, but I'll log it. We have uh, some idea. Slide here, boom. 
to the road. So the pack can take you there. Now you just rinse and repeat. You just go back. Pop the bear. I mean, yeah, if you pop a bear, you'll go pretty far anyways. This takes you... I mean, you can hit this straight on the zip line and hit the reboot. So you, you could get a really, really quick reboot here. Let's, let's max distance here. Boom. The rock. Wait, is this the right rock? So we got some directions here. I'm gonna go this way just so we have it, but I don't think you're gonna really need to do that. Boom, let's see. I should have gone to the right, but I'll just go straight in the water here. Get a rough idea. Auto run back, boom. Boom, boom. All right, you wouldn't really want to use the pad to go back north, but we're gonna try it here. It should spawn then though, like soon, right? Oh, here we go. Okay, so that character actually spawns. This is what I wanted to know. Watch the clock. 47. Forecast hour. Car uh, AIs spawn in the game exactly at zero. Boom, 046. That means, right, you just do simple quantum physics, okay? You go here, you go to pat, you go to slap distances. 37 seconds will take you past the tower, okay? So probably 35 seconds will take you to the tower, right? So you leave with X time on the clock, you get to forecast tower with boom, you're there right as soon as it spawns. It's exactly where the AI spawns. If I really, really cared about the exact second, I would go back and do it, but I'm gonna say it takes 35 seconds. Leave POI at one minute 21 second zone, right? Get AI. All right, now we can test the pad distance because that was something I wanted to do. So we got that down, that's huge. Let's test padding. I guess, yeah, straight, straight diagonal. How far can we go? Boom. Looks like I should go a little left here to go right to this valley or a little to the right if I wanted to go that way. Why not Why not go ASAP to farm the metal there? Yeah, I mean, no, you definitely can, but I'm, I'm putting that like, yeah. And yeah, you can't do pad with fizz. I just didn't want to do it because sometimes you might not have it. Pad distance, we got all the way to here, which is crazy. This is so far. Uh, Right here. Pre-hit pad before cash spawn. So land yeah, that's true. I'm going to put that in my notes. Pre-hit pad to uh, before zone pops get cash uh, on perf timing. We got that. Let's go straight this way. All right. Boom. Boom. Where are we? All right. Got it. Chilling. Now we go again. Rinse, repeat. Rinse, repeat. We have forecast tower again, so that's good. We don't need to test that, but we're going to continue to test this pad here. This pad is the most important one. So these, I don't really care. Like these little smaller ones, the micro pad, I don't really care about like seeing the exact like style, like the exact options, but I, I do want to continue to test certain stuff it's all it's all about learn, like knowing these pads and then knowing the things you can do after the pads like we talked about how there's a slap juice there that will take you from that slap juice to this zip line on perfect timing and then to that pad that pad will take you there so it's like things like that like combos where you can hit this pad i'm gonna test a couple a couple options for for combos here I'm doing this for you guys i'm not i'm not gonna land ritzy i have no no want or passion or care to land in this poi okay one thing i wanted to test here this boom pad max glide we can get into this cave so right to a reboot, boom. Do you need to hit a reboot? Right on in, right on in. And this reboot, is this, is there like, yeah, okay. So you can like, let me see. I need to learn this spot a little bit, but you can come in here. Like imagine, imagine you really, really, really need metal. Come in here, boom. Like, I know this, might, this is probably gonna be farmed, but like you could get something, right? Hit that pad and you're you're off. Like you could leave early, come through here. I'm sure there's like, once you learn this spot as well, like I don't know where this takes you, but. Boom, you come in here and you just you just do. Then like 10 seconds, you just from here to out. And now you're gone. And now you hit another reboot, more slap barrels, another car, like all this other stuff. Okay, let's go back. What are the mats here? Let's see. End builds. If you ever sucked on the hill, farm that one rock and you're up. Straight to the top. Boom. All right, let's do pad again. Let's see. Where have we not gone? I'll go this way and this option. Two trees, little tree, go boom, go boom. Two trees, little tree, probably like right here. Okay, now we go back. Let's see where this takes me if I go this way. I'm gonna color code these eventually, but. And yeah, you can go to the other forecast tower, which is right here, easily. 
And you have the timing now, so they all, all towers spawn at the same time. All you have to do is pad off that certain timing, which I'm gonna figure out in a second as well. All right. So for this little mini pad, we've got this way, this way. I don't really want to learn this one, but we'll do it. Big at rock, boom. Can you mark it? Boom. Twenty-eight seconds. Okay, so now what we'll do is we'll go to. Let me save this. Put this in this pad distance channel. Go to this. Um, go to here, here. Boom, 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 boom. Was that? What did I say it was? Twenty-eight seconds. Is there not forecast hour like a map? For this you guys see it am i stupid it's crazy they don't have it uh let's do 28 second 20 second glide time boom let's back out 